Okay, so stop. So the basic idea of the of our mechanism is to have this column of flex wheels push up against this pipe. Now, originally we're going to have it like this, not like this, but just for video purposes, we're going to show you guys it like this. So the basic idea is to have this get compressed, and then this is our compression bar. This is on a motor. It pushes up against this, and then eventually we'll have a better mechanism for this. This will push. It will get locked on due to these locks right here. These are gravity locks, but we can tension them later. These will lock on. They should get locked. And then if you look right here, now these flex wheels right here are tensioned up against this, tensioning this bottom row of flex wheels down here. So when we basically tell it to go, theoretically, it should go. So um, our issue with this is right now we just have it manually put onto the pipe. And what we're seeing is this column of flex wheels, the torque is so strong for our weight of our drivetrain that the flex wheels are, yeah. the flex wheels right here are skipping on their own um, shafts, shaft locks. So we're going to have to figure out how to fix that. So here we have the controller showing the left and right buttons that are used to control the arm and the flex wheel tower. As you see pushing this button on this side controls the tower back and forth for easy up and down movement. And then this button controls the up and down for the other one.